Ohio State University President Arthur Bayless shared his university's recent successes tonight, from campus improvements to new program success, all part of his annual State of the University address. Oak News 8's Dennis Valera attended the address for us. He's live at Idaho State University right now. Okay, Dennis, he talked about successes. Uh, what else did he focus on? The future, Jay. President Velas broke down some of ISU's strategies to get and keep students, also mentioning major developments to show ISU as being an academic leader in Idaho. Change is a constant. Everyone will tell it's painful. I know that for a fact. Uh, but it is important. Important to be a leader in education. To start off his annual address, President Velas recapped campus improvements and achievements. One included the success of college readiness program Bengal Bridge. The program is part of ISU's recruitment and retention strategy, which includes Bengal STEM Day, liberal arts high. Even the tuition lock pilot program is expected to help. It's the person to person communication that makes a difference. And ISU has uh, really embrace this and it's going to do a lot more. President Velas says ISU is taking a key role in medical education in the state, particularly with the soon to be College of Osteopathic Medicine. The medicine in itself is a huge economic ecosystem. Huge. It is the second largest in the world, other than energy. President Velas did bring up the need for diversity in ISU's future in light of the hate crimes toward Middle Eastern students in the spring. He says the students are doing their part, as is the community, to foster diversity. We are globalizing this university. We have been and we will continue to be so. The university exists for all people all over the world. Yeah, we live in Idaho, but we live as part of the world. President Velas kept mum about enrollment numbers, saying final numbers will be made available in October. He says he hopes to see more Idaho students. Live at the Stevens Performing Arts Center in ISU, I'm Dennis Valera. Thank you, Dennis. President Velas also talked about ISU's space in Idaho Falls. It recently had a 10,000 square foot renovation for a resident, his faculty, and new classrooms.